Hi and welcome to the Bears Weekend Dive Report brought to you by the Saudi.ca and MasterWaterman.ca. Oh, peeps, uh, it's been a very good dive week up until the uh, Southwesty blew it out uh, on Thursday. Uh, yeah, I just kept missing the fish on my dives uh, about a couple of hours too early and then a day late. and <laughs> Just haven't been on the fish, eh? But yeah, quite a few chaps got lucky this week. They've been getting their first scooters as wild some snooks thrown in as well even some uh, 4v action up north let's have a look at the fish of the week we have um, brett and uh, martin diaga his first cooter there and uh master record brutus all having a lack about dive clapping the cooters down south well done lads and we have uh, liam maloney as usual on the fish there zanzibar getting a bit of a break Nice cobia there, well done. We have Master Chris West, 17.8 kilo uh, cooter there. Showing the bullies have still got what it, what, what it takes. Looks like bullies are reeling with the cooter, eh? Besides uh, Byron's uh, lovely fish a couple of weeks ago. Well done, Master Chris. Then we have Don Solomon, Master Don, with his brand new personal best, Amberjack. 28.72 kilos there. Huh. Because he had a whole shoal of them all around him, man. All buses. In the pip. Well done, Master Don. Cooking on gas there, bro. And we have uh, Master Jugs. You want to be left out this week. Got a Wahoo there. And a boat dive down south. Well done, Master. We have Louis Gouy with a lovely little GT there, 17 kilos. I'm sure it up up north. Just before it got blown out by the west. Managed to get it past the sharks as well. Another spot to dive this week as well. And a shoal of sharks all around me. Well done, Master Louis. We have Quinton van Heerden managing to get into his first scooters there as well. Well done, Quinton. Like a fish on the left there, eh? South Coast boys getting on the good action as well. All right, let's get to see what the weather gods have in store for us. It's not looking too good. East is currently blowing. As we talk. Oh, it's been pushing the curtains here in my office big time. You can see swells going to be up down south. 2.3 meters tomorrow and it's switching around to a lovely afternoon with the light suddenly blowing um, so yeah for south coast i'd say sunday afternoon swell drops off as well 1.7 1.6 meters there's the there's the gap there if we have a look at uh durban and north yeah just east pumps through the night huh? although one or two of the weather sites have been getting it wrong and it does drop off at about 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock and then switch to an offshore or a circ uh, circular wind. So this may happen tomorrow morning. So north might be good tomorrow morning. You can see our uh, north. Less swell and less wind as well. So yeah, up north could be a go tomorrow morning. As you can see pumps through the night here at Durban. Not so bad on Sunday, but the wind is still there. The surf up a little. So I'd say, yeah, Durban and North, the gap is uh, Saturday morning. It might be a go up north on the Sunday morning. We'll have a look here, but it could get blown out and dirty. And anyways, as always, dive safe and straight spares from the bear.